For many, this is the last week of school. Teachers are sending home plans with students to continue learning during the break. Because Education Matters, KRK4 Suzanne Bruner shows us how they're working to avoid the summer slide. Days in a week. Doesn't matter what day of the week it is, during the summer months, College Station Kindergarten teacher Karen Green wants her class to keep learning. Summer slide is not a slide we want to get on. I want you to go to the water park and get on the slide. But when it comes to education, one, two, three. Ms. Green wants her students to have an easier transition to the next grade come this fall. The bowling alley, you know, free bowling. Well, use your math skills. How many pins went down? How many do I need to beat you? Just make it fun. It's about taking the pencil and paper away from the desk and having fun outdoors. Ms. Green is sending home a calendar to help parents with activities. Show me where you want to stay on the slide. Um, Meanwhile, fifth here. graders are also getting the extra push this summer. They will be learning things like changing classes, Lockers. Ruthie White says for the first time, PCSSD will hold a camp this summer that helps students prepare to transition to a new school. Sending home learning packets during break is nothing new. Ms. White credits them for improvements. We've seen a growth in our students in reading and in math, which is two areas that the kids are usually scoring lower in. It's all about practice and consistency. Next year when I see them in the hall, Ms. Green, I'm in first grade, and not feel like they're not ready. That will keep kids confident throughout the year. In Little Rock, I'm Suzanne Bruner.